E-commerce businesses often need to temporarily hide certain products due to inventory issues, seasonal availability, or other business factors. To hide products in your Shopify store, try Adify Hide Products app. With this extension, you can hide specific products or entire catalog and allow only selected individual customers, countries, or companies to access. Generate a secret link or add the password to let customers directly access your content. Let's see how this app works. Click on Apps and go to the Adify Hide Products. Here you can see all created locks. Click on New Lock to create a new lock. Add lock title here and select Priority. Activate the lock status. In Product Settings section, you can select all products, specific products, and collections. We select the minimal snowboard for now. Choose the option for unauthorized. You can completely hide the product, remove product link, or blur product image. To access locked product, you can enable secret link and passcode. We enable passcode for now and add the passcode here. You can authorize customers, countries, and companies to access the locked products. Authorized Customers option allows you to enable guests, all customers, or specific customers. You can disallow specific customers by adding tags here. Same like this, you can configure countries and companies' authorization. For these three conditions, you may specify that the products will be unlocked when any or all conditions are satisfied. Save these settings and let's go to the front end to see how it looks. Here you can see the minimal snowboard product is blurred. To access this product, users must need to enter a passcode. Let's go to the back end to see general settings. Here you can enable or disable this app and add the messages. This message will be displayed over the locked products when no accessing options are available. Guest user's message while accessing locked products. Passcode prompt message displayed when passcode is enabled. That's the end of this tutorial. Thank you for watching.